Hi, welcome back. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Welcome to everybody that's been hanging out for almost a half a year for me to post something. No, I'm not dead again. Everybody says, oh, you died from all this stuff. You no, I haven't died. The house exploded and all this counter here was all ripped out, floor ripped out, and took like three or four months to get all the repair work done thanks to some jackass breaking the dishwasher and then telling us, run a couple of loads through it, it'll be fine, and then it ruined everything. And then there's jobs that turn into bad jobs and starting new jobs and birthdays and more birthdays and holidays and all that stuff. Out of time. So here we go. I got to get a couple in, especially this one. This one is from Glenn Habanero Carney. This is the Bootleg Habanero Sweet Red Bell Jam from Uncle Carney's. Um, this is uh, it has cane sugar, red bell pepper, apple cider, uh, vinegar, pectin, habanero, and lemon juice. Sounds delicious. Um, let's see. It's from uh, ucbootlegjams.com, uh, manufactured and distributed in Plainville, Connecticut. Um, I'll put all the information and stuff on here, but it uh, sounds like he's got a whole bunch of different jams and stuff that are all either like like sweet, hot, 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 more hot, and all that kind of stuff. How can you go wrong with habanero? So let's give this guy a try. I bet Glenn thought I'd never get this done. It smells good. I can smell the bell pepper. Ooh. So we're gonna try it. I have some toast. Because I have some toast. Mmm, spread's nice. really good it's clear I mean I don't, I don't see I mean, there's little little niblets in there there's a, there's a tiny bit of heat it's a really good flavor mmm wow that's got a really good flavor it's really light like the if it's red bell pepper, the red bell has that little bit of sweet pepper taste, taste to it. And there's a little bit of heat. It's got habanero in it. It's hitting me right at the back of the tongue. It's not super, super, super hot. I think sometimes people miss the mark. And they, they try and make stuff that will peel the paint off the walls. I like spicy stuff, but I like spicy stuff with flavor in it. This is delicious. It's got it's 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 a great jam, nice flavor, and the heat doesn't overpower it. You could tell tell there's a little spice in there. It's it's not okay. If you think ketchup's hot, it's probably going to be hot for you. But if people that eat, if you can eat habanero like a habanero, if you can eat the uh, like even Tabasco sauce, you know we're we're not talking about blow your head off hot. It's got a little spice to it. You'll feel it on the edges of your tongue, but it doesn't overpower the flavor of, of the jam. This is really good. Wow. He sent me a message uh, that he's got a whole bunch of other different flavors on there. I'll, I'll post the different flavors that he's got, and I'll post the, the website that this came from. But wow. Go Glenn. This stuff's pretty awesome. Um, there you have it. Uncle Carney's Bootleg Habanero Sweet Red Bell Jam. It's uh, got habanero, uh, red bell pepper, some lemon juice, and all that kind of stuff. Set before here. Good for crock pot cooking, uh, glazing, grilling, marinades. Used with meat, seafood, tofu, and veggies. Sodium free, dairy free, cholesterol, and fat free. It's actually good for you. Well, there you have it. Get some of this jam, because this is some pretty good stuff. It's got a little bit of heat. I like it. It's, it's something I could have with breakfast and not have to have a beach towel on the way to work because I'm sweating my butt off. This is just, just the right amount, and the flavor is amazing. It's pretty good. Wow. Thanks, Glenn. Well, there you have it. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. If you like it, like it. Let's me know you like it. I'm not going away. I just had, had to take a break. Things are kind of crazy. Anyway, uh, 
check this place out. This guy's got some good stuff. I like it. I like it a lot. Where'd that come from? Anyway, I gotta go. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching and all that kind of stuff. Happy New Year. Today is the 30th. Tomorrow is New Year's Eve. Ooh, another year gone. Good riddance, 2018. Anyway, bye.